Hello everybody, Pazzi here. Welcome to Keyword, an interactive detective thriller. So this game is going to come up in two days on September 28th. And right now, it is time to try it out. Let's play the demo. Here we go. Honey, what are you doing? I'm drawing. Daddy, Mommy, and me. Daddy and Mommy? Wait, is this Daddy? Why does Daddy look like this? <laughs> because that's what Daddy looks like. Every day, non-stop. Daddy holds this in his hand, then that. Oh, then isn't Daddy pretty cool? And this is... Yep, that's... Mommy. She's fine. Didn't Daddy say before that Mommy's an angel? The angels in cartoons all know how to fly. Look, Daddy, look! I gave Mommy a telescope! Like this! She'll be able to see us, even if she looks all the way up in heaven, right? Yes, Mommy will. For sure she will. Then, little Sala, who's this cute girl in the middle? It's me, Sala, Daddy. <laughs> Use mouse to look around and inspect your surroundings. Well, the phone is ringing, guys. Ooh, look around. The neon nights. Where are we? So I wonder if mommy is dead or not. Dead? As the, an angel? But we did see mommy and a helicopter. Maybe he. Maybe she. So maybe she travels by helicopter. And is still alive and well? I don't know. Use mouse to look around and inspect your surroundings. Okay, phone is ringing, guys. I wonder if mommy is dead or not. Is she an angel? Or maybe she is still alive? Because we saw mommy and a helicopter for a split second. So maybe she traveled by helicopter. Maybe it was a divorce and she left the family. <laughs> I don't know, guys. Just guessing here. But anyway, let's pick up the phone. Hey, my daughter! I'm playing as a father then. My dear daughter, there's only a decline option here, guys. How do I pick up the call? You there, what is up? Oh, we are chatting. Uh, just doing regular chores, gathering some intel. What's up? Oh, not much. I want to ask if you've gotten a hold of the signed vinyl record I wanted. Well, um, yes, of course. <laughs> Have it right here. <laughs> Is it in the back seat? <laughs> of course, I bought it for you. Uh, you can you can do anything as long as you put your mind to it. My great detective daddy. I'm a detective. I'm a policeman. Also, not much happening here. When hanging out with classmates today was fun. Good to hear. Getting used to things. I think so. High school feels just like elementary school. And most people are friendly. Some of them look super cool. Like when tattoos and stuff. I'm learning about Texas Hold'em. Texas Hold'em? You mean poker? <laughs> I hope you're only playing in your spare time, my dear daughter. <laughs> Studying is more important. <laughs> Told you, there's nothing to worry about. School is cool, but I like daddy's breakfast better. Uh, by the way, you haven't even seen the inside of the building. The library is super nice. So, I guess my daughter went to a boarding school. Yeah, we don't live together, obviously, guys. 
so we live apart from each other. Well,、uh, when you get back home, I will cook you something nice. I'll pick you up on weekends, cook you something nice. Yeah, I think she is in boarding school. Yeah, that for sure. I'm heading off now. They want us to go check out the Kashia Free Market. Stay safe out there. It's late. Don't worry. There is a bunch of us. Love you. Bye. Bye. Press tab to open in my inventory. Daddy, come here. I'm on my way, honey. Come take a picture of me. What? Where are we, guys? Are we traveling in time, back and forth? <laughs> the past, the future, the present time is all mixed up. Okay, let's try pressing tab. Have my camera, my trusty camera. Oh, we can take pictures. Can look through the cameras. We can zoom. We can take photos. Interesting, guys. And we can put away by pressing the right mouse button. Can I remove the camera? <laughs> can we put it away? <laughs> you want me to walk with the camera? All right, fine. That's what we'll do. So, I heard my daughter's voice earlier. Is she on the boat? She's rowing on the boat. You're so far away, my dear daughter. Come back. Let me get on the boat with you. Take a picture, guys. Can we zoom in? Ooh, focus. That's as far as I can go. My dear, you've grown so much. New notification. So that was just a memory, a loving memory. Hey, who is calling me? Why won't you answer my calls? Oh, I missed it. It's my daughter, guys. Been with my friends. It's too late. We turn home now. What's the big deal? This isn't the first time I've stayed out. Can handle myself. Handle yourself? How? Like how you've handled that marijuana? Oh, no way! She's smoking marijuana, guys. Did you go into my room? Well, the smell was obvious. It is simple. I smell something suspicious. You admit it, don't you? Get home now. It's not mine. I'm just holding it for a friend. That is enough. I'm ordering you to return home. I'm with my friends. You are embarrassing me. You think your friends' opinions are more important than mine? It's not the same thing. You are doing it again. You still haven't explained to me what happened to my mom. Sala, you are still young. All will be made clear in due time. Not this shit again. Anyway, it's getting late. Come home, and we can talk about it. Sala, Sala, are you there? Oh no, guys, she's gone. I think we do need to come. It's already been three days since Sala's disappearance, 
and the police have nothing. Oh no. Sala, sweetie, where in the world are you? She's lost? She disappeared just like that. Okay, where are we? Are we inside our own room? Yeah, it doesn't look like my daughter's room. It's probably our own bedroom. So let's take a look around. Things that we can pick up. An article about Van. Hacker extraordinaire. Good read. Okay, we can rotate by dragging the mouse. Actually, you know, holding on to the right mouse button. So, do you want to know everything about the Riddle Man Van? It is released on Steam now. Cyber Manhunt, the new DLC. Hot releasing now. <laughs> Van, here are all the secrets. Everyone has the secrets. Someone just followed, follows the ruler that he abandoned. Someone chooses to control everyone. Cyber Manhunt. On Steam. <laughs> Take notes. You can use this widget to copy and paste important words, phrases, or just jot down whatever you want. Create a new note by clicking the button at the top right corner. Huh? What the heck is this? A new note. Enter the text. So, hmm, okay. I can do digital notes. I don't need paper and pencil, guys. <laughs> so any important clues or numbers, code words, passcodes, can just use our notepad, our digital notepad. So I don't see anything important here. Van, the name Van, that I can probably remember. Okay. I don't need to take notes for now. So I guess those objects that I can examine are the ones that are like that, that are highlighting, or the ones that are flashing. All these interactive objects. Therapy record. Huh? I've spent a fortune on therapy over the years. What was I trying to forget? Forget my wife? My dear ex-wife. Or maybe she's dead. My dead wife. Alright, I need... Uh, I c can I get a magnifying glass? <laughs> Or maybe that is not going to help, guys. I need a prompt that show me what this tech is about. Wow, I cannot read this handwriting. <laughs> and a page has been uh, ripped out. It's missing a page. We got an invisible page. Or just a rip out page. Oh, there we go. <laughs> it is here, guys. Guo Chen, 50 years old, male. Oh, it's Chinese. So I'm playing as Chinese man? Nice. <laughs> I was gonna say they look Asian, but I'm, I wasn't sure, guys. So they're actually Chinese. Uh, therapy record is an empty page. 33 years old. Chief complaint, frequent flashbacks of traumatic memories leading to mood swings, extreme depression, self-harming behaviors and suicidal tendencies, history of present illness, frequent flashbacks of traumatic memories in the past two months, mood swings, mainly depression, anxiety, easily ir irritated, easily irritated, repeated nightmares, vivid visual, auditory, and tactile hallucinations that disconnect uh, the patient entirely from his physical surroundings. Wow, what is going on guys? So many things wrong with me. So past history, diagnosis of depression, diagnosis of obsessive compulsive disorder, personal history, September 2030, suffer a huge trauma. He started receiving antidepressant treatment in November 2030. Severe depression, PTSD, 
mild OCD, currently uses electric shock therapy to reduce frequency and clarity of memory flashbacks, cooperate with Voltio Setin <laughs> Ari Prazo Laura Sepan and Prazo Zine for treatment. Okay, so 2031, March 24th. Hmm. I'm sure this has something to do with my wife. Dead or alive. In heaven or in hell. That we don't know. So, is that the same thing? Oh, wait! Oh, wait! 50 years old? 2048? Okay, so this is closer to the real time. I'm older than 50 years old. This is a new... A new record. Chief complaint, sleep disorder, load mood, history of present illness, Repeated emotional ups and downs in the past six months, mainly depression. Past history, diagnosis of PTSD, diagnosis of depression, diagnosis of obsessive compulsive disorder. Personal history, September 2030, suffered a huge trauma. He started receiving an antidepressant treatment in November 2030. This looks exactly the same as the early entry. Very similar, guys. So, anti-PTSD treatment and has received antidepressant treatment since 2035. Hypnosis has been used for anti-PTSD treatment. Mild depression PTSD currently uses hypnotic methods for memory editing, which reduces the patient's memory clarity of past events. Cooperate with Lamotrigine and anisomycin for treatment 2048 March 26 Hmm Okay Do I need to take notes? I don't see anything that requires note taking here It's just a history of uh, a history of illnesses and history of traumas. Alright, so this is my character. Hmm. I can see why I sent my daughter away now. Send her away to boarding school. Because there's so many things wrong with me. I guess I don't want to have a have an ill effect on my daughter, so I sent her away. Okay, this is her picture. Can it be open? I guess not. Take notes? No. And what is this? What is it? It's like a laser pointer. Is it a remote? Can press the button. Two twenty AM early morning, May twenty second, eighteen degrees Celsius. Cloudy. A cloudy night. Does it control the TV? Well, the laser light turns green when I'm pointing at the TV. So it's probably the TV remote. Ambient, photos, news. Ah, it is a remote. Ambient, backgrounds, pictures, screensaver. Photos in loving memory, Emerald Yin, two thousand seven. 
2031. That's my wife. I think that's my wife, my dead wife. My daughter looks exactly like her. Long, straight black hair and glasses. That is definitely my wife. Hmm. Substance E abuse in the city has proliferated. Hundreds have been admitted to local hospitals, over half of which are collateral victims of the violent drug abusers. Over 600 deaths have been recorded since the first documented usage of Substance E a few months ago. In order to curb the violence surrounding Substance E abusers and drug trafficking, the police have instituted a mandatory curfew starting at 9 p.m. and have urged citizens to visit the police force's official website for more information regarding the dangerous drug. Substance E ravages on. As people are getting used to the humming of delivery drones above, Black market trades are becoming a greater problem to law enforcement agencies around the world. While e-commerce has gotten cheaper, faster, and easier, so has the trafficking of illegal substances and firearms. New surveillance tech and legislation are desperately needed. Drones aiding traffickers. Tech news. Substance E abuse in the city has proliferated. Hundreds have been admitted to local hospitals. Over half of which are collateral victims of the violent drug abusers. Over 600 deaths have been recorded since the first documented usage of substance E a few months ago. Can we turn it off? In order to curb <laughs> the violence surrounding substance.、E、okay, ambient screen. There we go. Just repeating now. So substance E drug abuse. Wow. We got a map. Of the area. Oh, it's not a map. <laughs> no, it's only telling us the temperature and probably the humidity level. It does look like a map, the floor map, but it's not. Can I check out my daughter's room? Also, can I put in my? Also, can I put away my、uh, my remote control? Also, can I put away my remote control? Okay, there we go. The living room. Wow. I'm feeling Blade Runner, guys. <laughs> This is so cyberpunk. No fleshy items. Curfew in effect, 9 p.m. to 9 a.m. So I cannot even leave our house or our apartment right now. This is during curfew time. Oh wait, this item is not flashing, guys. I can pick this up. Ancient Chinese drawing. Eighteen levels of hell. Naraka is where souls are condemned to suffer. There are eighteen levels of Naraka, also known as eighteen levels of hell. In addition, these levels are, can be further divided into cold Naraka and hot Naraka. The inhabitants of Naraka experience no joy, only endless pain and suffering. And this is a piece of lore. You do not need this information to progress through the game. <laughs> Thanks for telling me that. Naraka. All right, can I type in Naraka? <laughs> Even though it's telling me that I don't need this information, feels like this word is important. All right. I thought all the interactive items are flashing, but this one is not. So that means I actually need to look around very carefully, guys. See the front door. Stand by. Stand by. 
And our workstation, investigate. Sarah. Sweeney, where in the world are you? So this is like the picture I took <laughs> during that memory trip. Ex the exact same one. Canada passports. We are in Canada right now. We are Canadian. That's me. Guo Chen. They are birth 1997. Place of birth China. It's a very cool looking passport, guys. It's a black. The base color is black. The rare, rare black. The black passport. This looks very cool. I like it. My workstation. Can I check my email? And use my computer. Password 1441. Wow. One four four one. All right, new task. Email received title police service center. So that's our email app. Flashing icon indicates information worth paying attention to. Okay. To do this, find your daughter. She is the most important person in your life, and you decided to take the search into your own hands. So I guess I have alerted the authorities already. Yeah, I am a police officer myself. So now I'll check the email. Neutron mail login. Uh I don't know my email address. Pass autofill. Ah there we go guys. Once you log into an account, the username, email, plus password combination will be saved. So Guan Chan at cityfromnot.com, mocking J. Shall we copy this down? I don't know. Do we need to copy this down? <laughs> I feel like if I need to uh, enter this email and password in another computer, then I will have to memorize this. Right? So it's better if we take notes right now. In case, just in case. So let me type this here in my notes. There we go. Easy. Police Service Center. Hi, Mr. Chen. We are sorry that we have not had any major leads so far. We would like your help for our investigation about your daughter. Can you look into your daughter's email or any other social media? Try log into her social account. The big social media companies take a long time for law enforcement queries. Maybe you will do a better job. Constable Karen Smith, Toronto Police Service. Hmm, I need to look for her email and her passcode. Probably in her own room, in her bedroom. So, updated objective, my to-do app. Okay. Now, we have a second email. Important notification for all residents. We regret to inform you that the elevator contractor, Ori, notified us that the traveling cable which was delivered for replacement after five months of waiting is the wrong size. Board of directors and the management are extremely frustrated this situation has left us with no choice other than waiting for the new replacement cable to be delivered. The board of directors, management, corporations, lawyers, and consultants will be taking necessary actions to hold Ori liable for their negligence. At this time, Ori has stated that they will resume repairs with the correct part on June 10th. Uh, June 10th. On June 10th, 
Further updates will be sent when more information is available. We apologize for the inconvenience caused and appreciate your continued patience. Sky Condos Management Team 301 Yoga Street. Okay, what about the other icons here? Place for you to spark. 